Yeah. No, it, no, it's you make us laugh. Away, it was in 2001. Uh, he's one of my best friends in college. We were classmates from first year to second year college together with our good friend, Mr. Ralph Rappels. Uh, Ralph, thank you for coming here all the way from Orange County, California. No. Anyway, um, during the time we were not yet nursing students, since uh, we were enrolled in the College of Home Economics, Nutrition, and Dietetics. So we are BS and students during the time. So anyway, uh, how in the world did we end up studying in the College of Home Economics and ended up becoming nurses? To cut the story short, during the time the BSN curriculum was an odd one, we must study associates of health science in education, which was a preparatory two-year course for healthcare courses like nursing. So I guess some of you guys were also in that curriculum. Or maybe only some because I think most of you are ahead of us. So kumbaga, mas matanda kayo sa amin. So, anyway, it's okay. So, biro lang. So, after two years of preparatory course, we were fortunate to pass the nursing aptitude test and became full-time nursing students by their third year. So, unfortunately, we have to part ways since we are based in different sections by third year. Later, later. So, anyway, but mind you guys, during the first and second year, uh, we were the best in our class. So Pancho was at the top of our class. So he, was, he was there, no? He was there, no? focused on his studies, stopping almost all of our exams in our class. So me and Ram really gets the highest score and we always set the the second and third. So anyway, Pancho was also one of the head turners in the college of nursing. So he was the in the magazine that was featured. So anyhow, to admire him and some even names him after Machete. Waka <laughs> Machete! Gardo Persosa or Cesar Montano Fisic according to so, him. Because according to him he looks like Machete. So, but Pancho unfortunately was not interested in women during the time because he was focused in his studies. So anyway, uh, to study the women in Western Mindanao State University in Zamboanga City, we are in a state university because we are, at that time, still in public. So we're poor, our allowances were just barely enough to meet our daily needs in school. Through hard work, perseverance, and constant prayer, uh, we survived I our made it over and all the three of us, Adonis, me, and Bob, are here now in the United States of America. If there is someone who knows Pancho that much besides his wife Melanie, so it would be me. Ooh. So I've known him since 2001 and have been either a good or a bad influence to him a lot of times. So we have also been together in Abu Dhabi, Abu Dhabi. United Arab Emirates. So it seems just like yesterday uh, when I called Pancho to attend an orientation conducted by Century Properties. Just yesterday, but it was uh, already like six years ago in 2012. The, the orientation was just two buildings away from their building. Well, uh, there was this pretty young lady who was a real estate agent of Century Properties. Who happens to be a nurse of another hospital that I wanted Adonis to see and meet. So anyway, who was this young lady then? So it was Mary. She was still young during the time, of course. <laughs> so anyway, we got the story. It was the first day, first day that they met, and their love story began. Ooh. They are indeed destined to meet. I know not everyone believes in destiny or in soulmates, but I do believe in it. I myself have a beautiful soulmate, my wife, who I was destined to meet as well. So we are hoping to find a match for Ralph. Ralph! So I'm very happy for Pancho that he met his soulmate. He apparently has been his biggest blessing. I have witnessed how he had struggled life prior to the meeting 
And I'm very happy for his blessings and what he had to have. He's now a great father to his children and loving husband, his wife. God for sure will bless them more in terms of health, more children, and more, more wealth. So ladies and gentlemen, can I ask you to stand up?